it is time for my annual winter outlook. My look ahead to the next three months of December, January, and February meteorological winter. But first, let's take a look at last winter, which wasn't much of a winter. As a matter of fact, it was the sixth warmest winter on record for the city of Evansville and the fifth least snowiest. We had only 1.5 inches of snow out at the Evansville Regional Airport. It was also a little drier than normal by about an inch and a quarter. And our February was the third warmest on record. All right, that was last winter. It was what we call an El Nino winter. And that's where the equatorial Pacific sea surface temperatures are warmer than normal. And this part of the Pacific is a good tool for seasonal forecasting. We call it the El Nino Southern Oscillation. Last winter, it was warmer than normal. That's what we call El Nino. This winter, it's trending cooler than normal. It's a weak La Nina pattern. So based on that, I went back and looked at all the winters over the past 75 years and found four pretty close matches to where we are right now. And the most recent one, the winter of 2017 and 18. And then I had to go all the way back to the 60s to find three more winters that were a close match. So based on those four winters, this is how I think our upcoming winter is going to play out. We'll start with December, of course, which is looking colder and wetter than normal. And there's no doubt about it, it's going to be a very cold start to the month. But despite the cold, wet pattern, well, based on those four winters, it looks like snowfall may still be trending a little bit below average for this upcoming December. But maybe, just maybe with these colder than normal temperatures in December, our chances for a white Christmas could be a little higher than normal. Way too early to tell with certainty. But that's just December. We still have to talk about January, February, and the potential for any severe weather this winter. And that's coming up in part two. All right. So we'll have part two right after the break.